Welcome to Heal Talk Tuesdays with Lisa, where transformation begins as we evoke, embrace, and evolve. Greetings, 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 and welcome to Heal Talk Tuesdays with Lisa. It's so good to be here with you, isn't it? Today is going to be something different and special. We're going to be talking about the powerful she. And before I go further, I hope your day has been a day of productivity and oneness with yourself. As always, I go, my the number three is so powerful for me because I when I think about number three is like a diamond, actually beauty, and in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, me, myself, and I, mind, body, and emotion. So three times three is a nine. That's why number 33 is so powerful. How are you doing? There's so much exciting things that we are working on right now. And one of them is exactly what I want to share with you. I've shared posts and uh, you may have seen some of the uh, posts and uh, advertisings that it's trickling down. But this may not be for everybody, and yet it might be perfect for just some of you. And um, so I'd like to extend an invitation so that I can into something special that I'm doing. It's a project that I am working on. And uh, if you don't mind, I'd like to share just a tad and delve deeper into what this project is. So someone asked me why, why this project? Why am I starting this project? It's called the powerful she. So what is the powerful she? I believe it is a collaboration. And a uh, few years ago, I approached our publisher and I said, I would love to bring some authors together women who are successful, who are, they, they have a story of bravery, courage, empowerment. They're touching lives of others. And I want to bring them all together in one book. And, you know, there are so many collaborative books that are happening and I've been involved as an author in a few of the books. And um, I have published my own book but this project was dear to me because I would love to bring 33 Armenian women together and uh, to showcase your strength, your courage, your story of all this. A woman of excellence who has gone over and accomplished so much by overcoming challenges of your own to be where you are today. Why? Because years ago, when I was a little girl, I used to lay at the balcony and we had this um, net, the mosquito net. And being in Iran, uh, the summers were really hot. So when we laid outside, there was always a mosquito. And as a little girl, um, I used to have a small little transistor radio. And this radio, I would have it with me and lay down, listen to it. And through the sounds, through the waves would come this beautiful voice of this exquisite storyteller, uh, Juanma Ardalan, I believe, if, it was, if I'm not mistaken. And she would tell stories every night, like a soap opera, but instead of TV, it was on radio. And it, it started with Yeki Bud Yeki Nabud, Khiras Khudahishkas Nabud. And it would take me to this world of stories. And I remember at that time thinking, what would it be to have different stories come together? So this beautiful imagery stayed with me until today, this time. And when I brought this project to our publisher with a friend of mine, he said, yes, go ahead and do it. 
So today we are taking applications. You can go to the powerfulshe.com and click over there, see it, read about it, apply. If this is you or you know of a woman who truly wants to be part of this project to empower other girls, other women, for them to show up, for them to learn how to stand up and speak up, then by all means, let us come together. We already have more than half of our book is already filled. We have um, almost there and we've got like 10 more, uh, 15 more slots to go, but it is what the intention is to bring and share a story that touches the life of another woman who can look up to you and be inspired by your story and realize that if you can do it, so can she. And that is so meaningful because in this world with so much negativity, so much going on that we think, well, my story may not be as powerful, but you don't know because your story may be one paragraph, one word. What you believe is not significant may touch somebody's life. And for that, that's why I called it the powerful she. So what do you get with this? You get 2,500 words and, and a chapter, and a chapter is going to be approximately seven to eight pages. You get your beautiful picture there, your bio, your social media. We're going to be promoting that. I am going to be interviewing you. Every single author will be interviewed and that clip is going to be on our powerful she website is going to be on social media will be on lisa.tv will be on youtube and we're going to share that so you can share with everybody else plus you're going to be a part of a speaker's panel at my 3e event the event that we are working on. It's at the end of September. It's happening locally right here in Glendale, California. It's the ninth annual women's empowerment event called the 3E event. So there is so much that encompasses your story, your bravery, and your courage and empowerment so that we can shed a light in someone else's life and that is what I wanted to talk to you about because I wrote something in here I started by saying when you hear do you listen as well and when you exit do you leave fully and when you look do you see beyond but most importantly what does being a woman mean we have so much from the moment we are a daughter and become a friend we become a girlfriend a wife a mother best friend sibling so I believe women truly come to juggle so much and I want to showcase you. I want to showcase our bravery and especially as a woman and as an Armenian woman, me as an Armenian woman and being proud of my heritage, my culture and my beliefs that was instilled in me from my grandmother that after the Armenian genocide, as a grandchild of an Armenian genocide survivor, I think that hunger in us is to stand up, to be brave as women of faith, love, and tradition. 
I'm so looking forward to reading this. Thank you so much. So any one of you who would like to join to be part of the powerful she or know of a woman who you believe her story ought to be part of this collaborative book as an author, by all means, click below, say yes, and join us. My name is Lisa Bubari. Yev urach gedlem, habart gedlem, yev yev por menk ganaints, harak fink yar head, yev et uju garo guchuna unenang, por urishnerin oknek. Again, I look forward to having you be part of this book. Until next week, I bid you goodbye. God bless you, and may the universal light surround you. Bari Or. Thank you for being here. If you want to check out some of the testimonials that I've got, click right here. But if you want to go back and watch other videos from a week ago, two weeks ago, even a year ago, click right here.